Welcome back to High Stakes. Elevate your game by subscribing to our channel and never miss our daily content. For exclusive access to our premium betting picks, join our Patreon, find the link in the comments section below. Stay ahead with High Stakes. Boston Red Sox vs Kansas City Royals The Boston Red Sox are traveling to Kansas City after their win yesterday against the Texas Rangers with a final score of 7-2. This would be their third win in their last five games as they continue a six-game road trip which currently has a record of 2-1. Left-handed pitcher James Paxton will be taking the mound for the Red Sox on Monday. James Paxton has an 8-3 record with an error of 4.52 and 69 strikeouts in 19 appearances this season. Paxton was 7-5 with an era of 4.50 and 101 strikeouts in 19 appearances in 2023. The Kansas City Royals are returning home after their win yesterday against the Detroit Tigers with a final score of 3-2. The Royals finish a seven-game road trip, which ended in a 6-1 record. Prior to this road trip, the Royals were struggling in their last five games at home as they had a record of 1-4. Starting for the Royals is right-handed pitcher Brady Singer, Brady Singer has a record of 8-6 with an error of 2.88 and 115 strikeouts in 22 appearances this season. Singer had an 8-11 record with an error of 5.52 and 133 strikeouts in 29 appearances in 2023. The Kansas City Royals are 2-1-9 as favorites at home this season. The Royals have a record of 7-1 on their first game returning from a road trip this season. Boston pitcher James Paxton has played one game on the road against the Royals in his career with the Red Sox. In that game, Paxton recorded a loss where he allowed six runs on five hits with two walks and only 1.1 innings pitched. The Royals are a hard team to beat at home, and although the Red Sox have been thriving on offense as of late, the Royals should find a win at home. I am taking the Kansas City Royals on the money line. The Boston offense has been dominating this season, as they currently rank second overall in batting average at .262. With the Red Sox ranking second in hits, it is no wonder why they are fifth overall in runs. Boston is not just getting singles to get on base, they have the second highest slugging percentage in the league and as a result are sixth overall in home runs. In their recent games, the Red Sox are performing even better on offense with a batting average of .316 in their last 10 games. On the season, Boston is averaging 4.9 runs per game, but in their last 10 games, they are averaging a massive 7.1 runs per game. Jaron Duran for the Red Sox has been a huge contributor this season, and as of late for the Boston offense. Duran is currently on a six-game hit streak and leads the team in hits and runs. This season the Royals have been above average when it comes to batting with a batting average of .253 placing them ninth overall. They are making contact in most of their pitches as they rank number one in strikeouts and fourth to last in walks. The Royals in their last five games have increased their batting average to .295. As a result, the Royals are averaging 6.8 runs per game. Hunter Renfro for the Royals has been contributing the most as of late with him being on a 10-game hit streak. This coupled with a pitching core that has done well this season with an era of 3.74, you have a team that can produce wins pretty easily against teams who are underskilled or underprepared. The Kansas City Royals have an over-under record of 3-1-1 in their last five games versus the Red Sox at home. The Boston Red Sox have an over-under record of 7-3 in their last 10 games on the road and 4-1 in their last five matches. We have two dominating offenses as of late facing each other and I am expecting them to continue to thrive in this matchup. Even Brady Singer who has a 2-1 record against the Red Sox in his pitching career still has an era of 4.11. This will be a higher scoring game so I will look toward the over. I am siding with the over at 9.5 runs.